Well, from the pool to the beach, we're down to the final few hours of summer 2024 down the shore, and many are making sure to enjoy every last minute. It'll soon feel more like fall. CBS News meteorologist Andrew Kozak is back with the chilly next weather forecast yeah. you'll wake up to tomorrow morning. See, off of 50 sound cool enough. How about yeah. some 40s no. for the Lehigh Valley? Mm. <laughs> the bogey, he's saying no. Well, unless you drive up there from the city tonight, then you'll be in the 50s. But some of you waking up with 40 degree temperatures, it will probably feel closer to 40 than 50 for areas like Mount Pocono. Meantime, we showed you a couple cameras across the Jersey Shore. I didn't show you this one, though. This is Atlantic City, the boardwalk. We have some really nice weather. Look at all the people enjoying crystal clear skies. Beautiful temperatures right now in the low to mid 70s across the Jersey Shore. We're going to continue that for at least the next couple of hours. Even as the sun goes down, we're going to be looking at very nice clear skies tonight. Let's talk about those temperatures because at the shore we'll start to see those temperatures drop down into the 60s pretty soon. But right now Atlantic City coming in at 79, Cape May at 78 degrees, Millville coming in at 79. Let's cross over the river here and uh, take a look at Dover at 78 degrees, Wilmington at 78, up and down all the way through the city of Philadelphia coming in at 78 degrees to Allentown at 73 and Trenton coming in at 77. It's a very nice afternoon. And yes, while we will start to see temperatures cool off quite a bit over the course of the next couple of hours, it's still going to remain comfortable out there. Well, that's what you saw in Atlantic City. The radar looking pretty much what you'd expect. Hardly any clouds, nothing to track at all. This is not just for us, but all the way up to Maine and all the way down to the Carolinas and Georgia. Beautiful weather continues really up and down for the eastern third of the country. Within the next hour or so in the city, we'll make it down to 74, 69 at 9 o'clock. And then we have temperatures overnight and into the wee hours of the morning approach 60 degrees by 3 o'clock, 55 as we head into tomorrow morning in the city. Today we made it to 80 degrees in the city, around 81 in Atlantic City, 81 in Millville, 79 in Wildwood. Only made it into the mid-70s in the Lehigh Valley and 68 at Mount Pocono. So over the next few days, we're going to be taking a look at the same thing. Temperatures dropping overnight into the 50s and then 40s to the north. Of course, we'll start that on your Tuesday. Plenty of sunshine, nice and bright. And then we end up in the 70s to near 80 degrees save for the Poconos that will be in the 60s. We start that again tomorrow and then move it again into your Wednesday and Thursday. And with that, of course, there are no chances of rain out there. Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, nice and bright. Friday, that 50% chance, that's going to be for increasing clouds throughout the day. Showers approach Friday night with our next system. By Saturday, likely a little bit of a washout. We're probably tracking rain throughout most of the day. That will come to an end as we head into the day on Sunday. For tonight, 55 degrees, clear skies, breezy and mild. That breeze will make those areas, especially to the north of the city, feel a little bit cooler than they actually are. So let's say you're about 45 to 47 in the Poconos, likely feeling a little closer to 40. Tomorrow, 77 in the city, 60s to the north, sunny skies, a gorgeous day. And yes, a little breezy tonight, but tomorrow, northeast winds at 5 to 10 making you feel nice and comfortable. All right, let's take a look at your seven day forecast. Now the next few days we will start off, of course, with Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday in the 70s to near 80 degrees, maybe a few more clouds Thursday afternoon, but we'll call it mostly sunny skies. Then we get into the weekend. Friday starts off with an increase in the cloud cover 79 and a chance for some late rain. Saturday, if you have any plans for the weekend, have a plan B for Saturday. We'll of course fine tune this as we get closer to the weekend, but it does look like we'll have a good chance for some rain Saturday into at least the first half of Sunday. By next Monday, we're back into the 70s. Of course, enjoy the beautiful weather now. We'll continue to track it for you and have a safe rest of your Labor Day. Siafa Aziza, 